Oh shit. Oh, we're doing this now. Okay. We knew this was coming. That's the teddy bear. Good. Let it out. You okay? I promise we're gonna get you home soon, okay? It's weird seeing her be nice. And that's not even that nice. She's it's like she's really trying to force it. Ana Lucia is uh, the new poop emoji. It's going to be a new category. Would you look after the children? Please take care of these children. There's something I have to do. Stay with this nice woman. I'll be back in a minute. I'm on the lookout for anyone that resembles a McPoyle. Racing this cute ski patrol guy. I went off the smogel, lost my edge, and bam! Oh, Libby. Snapped my left leg. Now that, that was bad. We're gonna find out that Libby was a dominatrix. Here in med school before I dropped out. Okay. I'm a well. Clinical psychologist. Damn. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Help! Oh, it's Bernard. Help! The burn. Bernard! <laughs> <laughs> Good job, Burn. All Look right, at that. hold on tight, okay? Yeah, he's like a koala. He ain't going anywhere. A koala. Is he just gonna sit there and stare out at the ocean like Rose? Couldn't find any matches. Dry ones? I didn't ask around, but I couldn't find any. Gotta get a signal fire started so they can find us. What are you, a Boy Scout? Grown up version. From the Peace Corps. That guy looks like a Lannister. Good one. Oh I'm no! <laughs> You were the one who pulled the dead bodies out of the water? Or were any of them African-American? No. Oh. I, I hate to interrupt this emotional moment. But how the hell is that a BC gonna know? I'm sorry, um, uh, um, Mr. Echo. How's he gonna know if they're African-American? He's not an African-American, right? Uh, it's an international flight. How many black people did you pull out? Was any of them like, you know, a lady, like 50 ish looking, uh, kind of boring? <laughs> I mean, I'm just saying, be more specific. I will pray for her. Where the hell are the rescue planes? I will pray for them too. Huh? Is Mr. Echo like a priest or something? Like some kind of, uh, what do they call it? Like a missionary? Wait, are those others? Okay, maybe he's not a priest. <laughs> Who are these people? I don't know. They're out here in the jungle with no shoes, nothing in their pockets, no <clears throat> labels on their clothes. These people were here before us. Brilliant work. <laughs> Brilliant work, Sherlock. And people who are seriously hurt. Where are we gonna go? Hmm? How are we gonna move them? We don't need a fire for them to find us. 
Yes, we do. Before the crash, the pilot said we'd lost communication. We were turning back. We were flying for two hours in the wrong direction. They don't know where to look. Hold up. Am I crazy? Okay, so that's the jungle. She's her. The other lady's back is to the beach. Right. They pan over. What is that? What is that in the background? That looks like another island, unless there's a, a friggin' tsunami uh, coming at them. What is that? Like, the only way this makes sense in this shot is if the island is like, if this part of the island is like a peninsula, like maybe it it wraps around like big time. But that looks like a whole separate, like that looks a long ways away. Don't spoil anything for me. Uh, just, I'm just saying that that's weird, right? That's a weird shot. I can't, I, I can't even tell what I'm looking at. It could be like, I, I have no idea. It's Donald. His leg, the infection is getting worse. He'll be the fourth to go. What are we supposed to do about that? I mean, you're the only doctor, right? I, I kind of like Anna Lucia more in this episode than I have so far. She got, she got points for killing Shannon. <laughs> I'm just saying. Wow. So they're just, they're all dying of infections and starvation and stuff too. They didn't have a fisherman. They didn't have a doctor. Y'all aren't hungry enough. What was that, bro? He, he put his whole torso into that. He put some torque. All you do is just, you know, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But no, you just crack it like a whip. Spin it. Crack it. Snap it. Why aren't you talking? I beat two men to death with a rock. It wasn't your fault, you know. You were just defending yourself. Libby seems, Libby seems a little too, I don't know. She seems a little too nice, maybe a little too naive. Where were you? I had to go to the bathroom. We have a system for that. We go in You know what? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Look at the forehead. Okay. This dude. This is this is Ethan's brother if Ethan ever had a brother. Look at this guy. He's all off in the jungle all sus. Look at him. These people are uh these people are different. Look at th this is him. I'm right about this. This is the dude. He's like their Ethan. It just infiltrating I know a Neanderthal when I see one. Oh, oh, they brought the big squad this time. The kids! We took the cat! What is that? It's a list. Nine of us. Like, they know your names? A list? Like, what's on the list? They drag nine people into the jungle. The kids. And there's no sign of them? What needs to happen to make you say something? Hey, calm down. Let's figure this out. Here are the names of every single names. person they took. All nine of them. What they were wearing, what they looked like. Oh. One of them had a list of us. 
Yeah, he gave it to him. Our names from the people they already took. Nobody knew anybody's names the first night. Maybe they're watching us. You were gone for two hours yesterday. What? Where were you? I was going to the bathroom. Hey, stop! Whoever they are, they know we are here. We need to leave this beach. You said we needed to keep the signal fire burning. I think it's time we let it go out. You don't need two hours to go to the bathroom in the jungle at night. You don't know what's about to crawl up in your stuff. Trust me, you're not taking two hours to do any kind of business in the jungle at night. I watch, I watch enough Naked and Afraid. I, I, I can't get enough of that shit. I don't know why. It's so dumb. <laughs> Like, if, if you got a bunch of people that are good at surviving, right, survival skills, let them showcase that. I love I love stuff like that, like alone and things like that. I'm sorry to, to distract myself and you, uh, but it just makes me think of that. Like, there's no question. Uh, okay, you were going to the bathroom for two hours. No. No. In fact, these people aren't covered in nearly enough bug bites in general. We've been walking for three days straight, Anna. And you're still here? Five minutes. You know what? I want to keep walking. Go ahead. Fresh water, rock wall at our backs, lots of fruit trees right here. Looks pretty good to me. You said that Nathan was gone for two hours, that he was missing? He creeps me out, Anna. You really think it's possible that one of us was missing? Wait. Wait. Back at the beach, the night they came back, you said that Nathan was gone for two hours, that he was missing? Okay, his name is Nathan. Nathan, Ethan. There's probably a Stefan, uh, a Muffin, I don't know, but come on. The two names are so close together. Did the showrunners do this to me on purpose, man? Nathan, Ethan. <laughs> oh, I'm just going to, I'm just going to stick with McPoyle. It has a higher comedic value. Creeps me out, Anna. You really think it's possible that one of us is one of them? Why do you think I'm digging this hole? Oh, hey, Anna. <laughs> Anna! What are you doing? You and I are gonna have a little talk, Nathan. He wasn't on the plane. What? We were in the air for two hours. I didn't see him once. Not once. It's a big plane, Anna, just because you didn't... No, I didn't see him either. Well, I'm pretty good with faces, you know, of the passengers. Nathan, every oh, she's time a I flight ask him attendant. anything, he just dodges. No, if he really were one of them, why would he still be here? I don't know, but I'm gonna find out. Where are the kids? Where are the kids? How come nobody saw you on the plane, Nathan? I was in the lavatory. For two hours? I don't remember seeing you on the plane, I don't lose. He has IBS. <laughs> he has something wrong with his ass. That's the he, he was on the plane. <laughs> Where What's that behind you? Get up. I'm trying to find out what they did to us, and you're taking care of them. I didn't do anything. Whose idea was it to stay at the beach where they could pick us off one by one? His, Nathan's. Well, they haven't come. You? She's like, damn it, you're the one person's ass I can't whoop out here. Do you have any kids here? I hope not. No. Okay. Whew. We should let him go. We're not savages. If I were a savage, I would have cut off his finger already. That's tomorrow. I believe her. I think she'd do it. Is she military? Is she like a, a military 
person. I can't remember if, if she said what she, what she did. This is crazy. No backstories, no nothing. Grab the rope. I'll pull you up. You know, Lucia, is, uh, I think we all think that she's going to hurt you. Which way's the beach? That way, maybe five miles. <laughs> Okay. Okay. So I guess the the Lannisters and the McPoyles are united. He's like the Lannisters send their regards. Morning. Morning. Nothing creepy about that. He's gone. Nathan's gone. That's that's pretty smart because it makes it look like he he escaped his people busted him out or something it throws any shade off of the rest of the group that's that's pretty that's pretty diabolical what is it i don't know some sort of bunker do you think it's theirs quarantine right on the door and they aren't even going to show a reaction to that. No one noticed it. Hold up. No, because all I can think of... Uh, uh, okay, it's an arrow with Dharma. It's an arrow. Okay. Uh, all I can think of is like Baldur's Gate. Some of you know I play that game. And it's a Dungeons and Dragons based thing. And everywhere you go, it rolls a dice to see if you notice something. And they all failed miserably right there. Like every single person in the group rolled a one. I'm sorry I had to mansplain dice rolls to anybody. Nerd splain? Hey, come over here. Wow, their bunker kind of sucks. Like we never really got to see how big it was, huh? It's a glass eye. What? It's a radio. This is so like Hello? a video game. Hello, can anybody hear me? We want a signal. We need to get to higher ground. I'll do it. I'll go with you. No, you should stay here, Anna. Get this place set up as a shelter. We can all get it set up. We can make it back in a couple of hours. Let's go. It's a trap! Why do you think they're doing this? Why do I think who's doing what? Don't you ever wonder why they attack us? Maybe they're not attacking us. Yeah, they just drag us into the jungle every now and then. No real harm done. Why do you think they take some of us and not the others? You know, that first night they took the strongest of us, our quiet friend, three other guys. They're all athletic, tough, threats. They didn't take you. Boy! Guess they changed their plan after two of them got killed. Can I have the knife? She's gonna kill this guy. Is that a mango? Where do you think they got it? I mean, they don't even wear shoes. How'd they get an army knife? A knife. It's U.S. military. She's Here. military, huh? You see the Tang stamp? This knife's probably 20 years old. <laughs> you don't see these anymore. Can I ask you something? Sure, Anna. When you ran out of the jungle the day of the crash, how did you... How did you find Bernard up in the tree? I heard him shouting from the beach. From the beach? Why are you asking me about that, Anna? Did he see you out there? Is that why you pretended to be one of us? You ran out of the jungle 10 minutes after the crash. You weren't wet. You were never even in the ocean. Where are they? Your friends. Everywhere? Nathan. What did you... If you had cut off his finger and he still told you he was on the plane, I think maybe you would have started to believe you had the wrong guy. Did you kill him? Nathan was not a good person. 
That's why he wasn't on the list. Wait! What about the kids? Did you kill them, too? The children are fine. They're better off now. I mean, I know she wins, or at least gets away. So wait a minute. Wow. So, okay. We're led to believe that he died to the others. Ugh. So why not? I I'm confused as hell. Does she not tell them? That he is one of the others so that she doesn't look bad for throwing the dude in the cage. I I'm very confused. Like, why wouldn't she have told, you know, Michael Sawyer, Jen, them like, th no, he was, he's one of them. We killed him. Like she's keeping that to herself. I'm assuming. Where's Goodwin? Turns out he wasn't so good when. Why are you wasting your time with that thing? There's no signal. It really doesn't. Hello? Hello? Anybody out there? Mayday, mayday. That's Boone. Is there someone there? Hello? Hello? Right? That's Boone. Who is that? Who's the survivors of the crash of Oceanic Flight 815? Please copy. We're the survivors of Flight 815. No, no, wait a minute. What are you doing? It's them. No, he said 815. He said flight 815. We know our flight number because Goodwin knew our flight number. Oh, my God. No, but what if there really are survivors out there? There are no survivors. This is our life now. Get used to it. Okay, she's back to being the poop emoji. So the subtitles lied to me. The subtitles lied to me. I don't care. I'd be fighting. I'd be fighting him. No, look, I can't stand it if I'm trying to talk to somebody and they just ignore me. What? I, I, I don't think I've even ever actually been maybe once or twice in my life in a situation like that. If, if you're if you're in this situation and somebody just walking around ignoring you. Screw you, man. I know you can talk. Like, contribute, you know? You just stare at me coldly. You son of a bitch. What, you talking now? It's been 40 days. You waited 40 days to cry. Libby. Is that Jin? Okay. Where are you? Where are you from? Where are you? Oh, what's your name? Huh? He doesn't even speak English. That doesn't mean anything. Anna, we found him in the water. He has a broken handcuff on his wrist. I'm not sure that is a threat. He's running! Yeah. Oh, yeah. Give us a montage. Hit me. Hit you. You think they're okay? Let's find out. Hit me. It's still my move, right? I choose backhand this time. Really? Backhand! <laughs> no, I can piece it together from here, guys. You don't have to... Right, right, right. Yes, we did this. Yep, yep. Oh, do we get to see her kill, kill Shannon again? This seems like they're just, uh... 
filling in space. You're going to die. <laughs> they did that like the build up to a WWE main event. <laughs> wow, man. Uh, so that was cool. It's like. They had a way, way worse time. And uh, I apologize to people with large foreheads and close set eyes. <laughs> You're not all McPoyles. Uh, some of you can be handsome Lannisters. Some of you can be good ones. Oh, this show, man. This show is a trip. Okay. Well, I think we're all caught up now. I, I'm I'm kind of surprised. Like, I thought the other group was going to be, you know, roughly the same. But, man. It's almost like they focused on the tail first, right? Like, they, they put... They threw Ethan at our main group. And they threw Goodwin at this group, but they were maybe they're closer to their to their base or something. Wherever that is, like, wouldn't it be messed up if they, they, they had access to all these bunkers this whole time? That's crazy, but it seems like the other bunker was just like a big. Just a room. With some lights in it. So I, I guess now it's uh it's official the tribes have merged. And uh we'll see how it goes with Anna Lucia. <laughs> she's pretty tough. I don't know. I think maybe her her I think she's probably like military or ex-military or something. And we know Saeed can scrap, right? So that might be a pretty good tussle. I'm anxious to see that. In fact, I might just watch a few more episodes today. Uh, it's 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 a Saturday, so you know, no sweat. I, I I'm probably missing something. I definitely like was blown away by the the whole communication on the radio. I thought in season one when Boone picked up the radio in the plane and he was legit talking to someone somehow. Like, in the real world, it sounded like they were talking to somebody from an air traffic controller. So, right? Like, somebody somebody that had answers towards them. There was no survivors. So, it kind of made me think, like, maybe these people were, you know, in some kind of, I don't know, afterlife purgatory place. Or maybe it's hell. I don't know. Maybe that's the duality of, of, of hell, is that it, it's a beautiful place. Uh, but also there's Ethan and Shannon sometimes. Anyway, uh, drop a like and subscribe if you're new here. And, uh, if you're new here, why are you starting here? This is like the worst place to start. Go back. I looked worse in the beginning. Uh, I think we're good now. Oh Yeah. I almost forgot that I was on the beach. Anyway, we'll uh, catch you guys on the next one. And uh, stay safe. Take care of each other. Peace.